Yo, what's going on, everyone? Welcome to another episode of the Slope Podcast. Hey, you know what it is. Your weekly podcast on the Sakamichi series, Auto Groups, and Minogi Zaka 46, Sakura Zaka 46, Hinata Zaka 46, and Yoshimoto Zaka 46. This is season three, episode 27. These episodes are recorded live on our podcast. Uh, Twitch channel twitch.tv slash slope club every Tuesdays at around 7 p.m. Pacific time. I'm one of your hosts. I'm Jimmy A.K. Swoltaku, and I'm joined as always by my friends, my fellow hosts. We have Boy Boy Coon and Josh, Mr. Josh Bucks. What How's up? it going, fellas? Yo, okay. it's going. I finished my class today, had my final. Oh, it was hey, like let's at go. 7 a.m. So early, man. I get my coffee, I'm like, ah. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, it wasn't too bad. Okay, okay. So you're off for a little? For a week. Oh. My Ooh, next class it, starts on Monday. Oh, no. A little less For than the next week. semester? No, for like some, the, the some second summer class. I'm oh, okay, okay, okay. Mm-hmm. So it's one yeah. summer class and then one summer class? Yeah. yeah. Oh, one okay, a month. Okay. So. Oh. Yep. Hmm. Yeah, my summer class is still for another two weeks. Stats in six weeks is a, a lot to take in. Oh, I, yeah, I can't imagine. Mm-hmm. A lot of content. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It was I the, uh, started. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. I started decorating my room. Well, I started getting my room Dude, ready. Dude, it looks so, it looks great. Not it like looks you great. Can you tell the difference? <laughs> mm, so, no. You can see some storage boxes I have for like equipment and stuff. Uh, it's a darker color now in the background instead of that old stripe I had before. So yeah, it's, it's slowly again, starting to come along. Yeah. Again, at least I had to move the bookshelf. You've moved things. Yeah, the bookshelf was a hassle. Yeah, there used to be a, a lot of uh, lewd idol covers on the side. Mm, yes, but, you know, it gave it gave some personality. You know, <laughs> like I took yeah. a picture of like the side to side of the forty eight versus the Sakamichi books I had. I had a little oh, yeah. bit more. I had a little bit more um, AKB AKB ones or like forty eight groove. Why doesn't focus focus? Oh really? Well, I think I think it's just because AKB's been doing it longer, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. True. Like uh, I mean, like you know, there the Sakamichi books were like few and far between back in the day. Mm, and true, I would say true. like the past few years has been the uh, the surge. Right? There's been a yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. a shift. As mm-hmm. Nogizaka has overtaken AKB4. Yes. <laughs> as they admitted Matsui on their new Jirina TV show. was right all along, dude. Jirina mm. was right all along. That's all I'm mm. going to say. <laughs> She's yep. that stupid, like, what is it? Uh, Andre, like, what is it? Eric Andre meme, dude? Oh, or no, no. Uh, the, the Hannibal. <laughs> Why would you boo me? I'm right. Oh, I'm right. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, it was, uh, you know, the the like the list thing I started last week uh, where mm-hmm. you like write things in a little book and cry. it's it's mm-hmm. going okay mm-hmm. but the thing is oh, like, okay. I'm having like trouble finding things to actually do that's like oh. worth <laughs> writing in the book <laughs> I'm just like uh, finish the doc for the podcast <laughs> even though I already do it like mm. right? it's supposed to like start new habits not like oh, okay you know, like, I don't when know. you start writing, think of things to fill in lists. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. So, mm. I don't know. I guess, like, if mm. I want to start something new, it would help. Oh, yeah, dude. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, practice guitar for 30 yeah, minutes. Stuff or something like, like that. that you know? mm-hmm. Draw for an hour. So, yeah, little things, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. So, I've been putting things that are, like, once in a while put off, like going to the gym. Mm. No bench. Should I write down go to the gym today? Nah, I won't write it today. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Nah, at least I think for me, at least that helps with the motivation to go. Like oh, damn, mm. I, gotta, I gotta get this crossed off yeah. today, so I went. Mm. Yeah. It's cool. Uh, I saw this girl. She, uh, I don't know, probably at most weighed 130 pounds. She squatted 225. Ooh. I was like. I was looking at her, like, dang, I wish I could be like her someday. <laughs> well, I did my tricep extensions. Damn. <laughs> that 
<laughs> this reminded me when I saw these this group of dudes trying to hit on this girl at the gym once, and uh, Wait, I mean it's group? fine to like, yeah, yeah. It was like, well, we I mean, not group group. It was like like three dudes, right? I imagine like, like, like seven like, dudes going up to one girl. <laughs> hey, <laughs> <laughs> um, well, okay, because like she was, she was in us in one of the squat racks, and this is before we got a bunch of them. So there was like three in the whole gym or whatever, right? And then so they're I guess they're waiting for the squat rack, and she's uh she was squatting and then. You know, actually, she finished. It's like I, I can I can respect the like you know admiring someone and or like you know being down with like a, a, a female being stronger than you as a guy, right? Like cool, but I don't know when you're when you're when you're gay when your game plan is to like approach a girl who is clearly not interested because she has her headphones on and is trying to work out, and it's like. Damn, girl, you lift like more than I can. As if that's supposed to be like a compliment, <laughs> uh-huh. you know? I was like, clearly she lifts more than you. She's like a dedicated power lifter, dude. You're just <laughs> some guy. <dude>. You know? <laughs> <laughs> like, oh man, like my secondhand embarrassment was so bad. I was mm-hmm. just—it was one of those things I should have been focusing. But I was like, like maybe like I don't know, like twenty feet away on my bench, just. <laughs> just look fixated. He's just, just watching watch how this goes down. <laughs> <laughs> Reminds me of like when people hit on people on Zoom calls, like in class. Like yeah. this is one, <laughs> this is one on Twitter. There, there's this one on Twitter where like they're on a Zoom call and then afterwards, like in, like the guy messaged the girl, "Hey, you on the Zoom call, you look kind of bad though," <laughs> and put a winky face. She's like, "What? <laughs> she kind of bad though." That's funny, dude. Everyone in my Zoom like classes have their cameras off. <laughs> No one knows yeah, what anyone looks like, so there's yeah, no dude, chance see- of like hitting on somebody else, dude. Uh, uh. Uh, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, you guys want to see what my Zoom, my Zoom video looked like, but I was gonna turn off my camera, but it's a picture of Habu, <laughs> and I'm definitely do not use Habu as my Zoom <laughs> <laughs> picture. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Hey, it was the fourth of July the other day for these Americans. Oh yeah, uh-huh. Mm-hmm. yeah. Freedom, you think? shit. No, I uh, purposefully did not work that day, so like I made my schedule around because I knew uh, I would have gone like mandated. So I just mm-hmm. stayed home with the doggos, mm-hmm. watched Independence oh, okay. Day. Oh, Ooh, the most fitting. Oh, Will okay. Smith, <laughs> Jeff Goldblum mm-hmm. beats the aliens. Nice. What about, you, what about you, Josh? Um, like I said earlier, I, I studied and then I did a test. Oh, Good shit. I got a B plus on it. Hey, so congrats. Came you. out all right. Yeah. Not bad at all. Mm-hmm. I, uh, I had like a little friend barbecue thing at my place. Um, it was nice, dude. It, it reminded me of shit I used to do before the pandemic, dude. Oh. Right. Uh, I actually, I used to always kind of host like friend dinners and things like that. You know, like little Sundays at our place where everyone brings food. We'll have like some drinks and just chill and things like that. And obviously, you know, we haven't been able to do that for a while. But um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. yeah, it was nice. Mm-hmm. Bought some some truly hard seltzers. In the cooler. Oh. Bought a Ooh. bought a new grill. <laughs> hey. Uh, oh. Yeah, because uh, it, it's it's very unnecessary, but uh. Like, we have one part of our backyard that we generally hang out in. And then mm. our grill is a, a gas grill that's, like, hooked into the, the pipe over on the other side of the backyard. And it's, like, around the corner. So, like, I hated mm. grilling when friends were over because it's, like, everyone's chilling over there and I'm just by yeah. myself. You know, yeah, one yeah. friend might come down to hang out with me for mm-hmm. a bit. So I was like, no, I'm buying the Weber grill. I'm putting it on that side. <laughs> and so, uh, yeah, we did that. It was good. Felt, I was like, mm. oh, this is what... This is what life was like, huh? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Getting back to normal. Yeah, dude. Hanging. I'm getting, uh, I'm getting emails and text messages asking me to come referee powerlifting meets Ooh. again. And I was like, oh, Ooh. man. It's Ooh. time, oh. dude. Mm-hmm. It's mm-hmm. time. Mm-hmm. Nice. Uh, hopefully we will meet. Oh. Don't know soon. when that's going to happen, dude. But yeah. I hope it happens soon. soon. Let's plan it. Soon. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll, we'll we'll figure it out. We'll figure it out, guys. Let's. Uh... You guys want to hang out this weekend? <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm free. I, I don't know. I think I'm busy that day. I'm I'm going oh, to some gosh, Korean gosh. barbecue place or something. Shit. Oh, we're <laughs> have fun, dude. <laughs> Let's talk about some idols, man. What's up inside yeah, the series? Let's get into it. 
First up, uh, the shilling corner, kind of. Not shilling exactly new products, but just like continuations of what's been. Um, Sakura Zaga, still supported by Aeon Card. Bless Aeon Card mm-hmm. for uh, for doing that. And, you know, they bo- they've they been doing these talks, right? Like with, with members. Um, the first one with Morita, second one with uh, Honos. Third one has Risa in a very like ele- elegant setting. Uh-huh. She has like, mm-hmm. the jazz piano. <laughs> it's yeah, like at a hotel. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> it's like, what the heck? Uh, Nabe talk. Uh, mm-hmm. She had a butler, man. <laughs> I was like, what the uh, heck? Just, just <laughs> standing like, next to her. <laughs> who's that? Oh, oh, lady, the butler. Oh, lady oh, okay. Risa, dude. <laughs> yeah. Like the other members come in like, yo, what the hell? What is going on? She like sends him to get drinks. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, yeah, it's just them talks. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Just like the others have been. Uh, I, I love the piano guy, dude. He's just chilling. Like, he's just there like happening? playing. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, yeah. Is, so. this a, is, is this entertainment? <laughs> mm. um, I, I am a little bit so. unsettled by, by how nice everyone looks in this though. Mm. Our, our girls, unsettled. our girls are all grown up, dude. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're like beautiful young women, dude. I and I hate it, dude. Where are my weird little kids, bro? <laughs> Weirdo kids. Where are my angsty little no more. emo teenagers, dude? Who are these <laughs> fine young ladies, dude? These Ojo Samas, dude. <laughs> Time passing so quickly. So if mm. you want to watch this, it's on the AON Card YouTube channel, just like uh, all the other commercials and. Related promotional content. Mm-hmm. Check it out, y'all. I'm gonna keep going to more uh, commercial related things. Cup Star with Nogizaka. Oh, uh, yet another episode of that drama series sitcom type thing. I'm not actually watching this. This is just an excuse so that we have something to talk about in the shilling corner. Oh. Uh, I have not watched it, just like how they have not watched our email that we sent them. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. Um, Please. But yeah. <laughs> what, I think what, we must, talked about, what must we do? <laughs> I think we talked about in the past where uh, it's not like super serious of a of a, like drama, right? They'll break character a lot. And so it kind of mm. makes it funner to watch. Uh, yeah, so. yeah. Mm. Check it out. Seems cool. Yeah. I like the set. I just don't watch it. Yeah. Same. I'm just here to appreciate the set dressing. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Mm-hmm. Look at that orange shelf in the back, dude. Nice. Mm-hmm. All right. <laughs> nice choice. Um, yeah. So that's it for the shilling corner. No actual products to shill. But uh, if y'all want to support the Slope podcast, please reply to our emails. At least, like, you can reject at least, us. At least tell us no. <laughs> yeah. Yes. You know, it, it's 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 harder to just leave us hanging, dude. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So. And and for the people watching this, if you're really looking for something to spend money on, oh. let's move on to the current events. Yes. Oh. Uh, Double Kiaki Festival mm-hmm. is almost here. Yes. It's like <laughs> next week. Yes. So there, there are a lot more content that they released. Mm-hmm. Uh, regarding Double Keiki Festival. First, light stick color combinations. So even if you are going to be at home to watch the um, stream or whatever, you can mm-hmm. still mm-hmm. do it. I mean, they won't see you, but uh, you yeah. know, you can take a picture and put it on Twitter or some shit. But uh, here we go. Sakurazaka. Light stick combinations here. Um mm-hmm. Aoi's is like pure white. You can't even see it. It's just a... Mm. <laughs> that squint for that one, dude. Uh, I heard Risa's Rundrum is Rundrum's white is and blue. Who do you guys think have interesting colors? Drundrun does. Look at hers. Second to last. Gray and gray. I think it's like whatever the fans want. Mm-hmm. So mm. she doesn't really give a damn. right? I think mm-hmm. that's what that says. 
Um, so, <laughs> what I'm like, leave it to y'all. Just whatever. turn them off. When it's my turn, turn them off. <laughs> <laughs> no lights for me. <laughs> That's how I'm I know like, how many true fans I'll have. Hikaru. <laughs> if like, I see you holding no up lights, something please. with no lights... Uh, that's mm. how I know. <laughs> just, just black it out, brothers. Just black it out. <laughs> no um, that, It kind of reminds me of way back when, uh, I think it was Techie, it was like, rather than having, like, my color, I'd rather each song have, like, a color. Mm-hmm. Right? Yeah, so it's that's like a pretty party, good idea. Like, you know, like, Paruko would be red. Mm-hmm. Right? And at yeah. first, I was like, uh, I don't know, you know? Like, I kind of... I kind of like the idea of like really showing your support for a member and things like that. But then like as I'm looking at these color combinations that they've got to get going to give everybody something different, I'm like, maybe she's onto something. You know, maybe Mm -hmm. she was onto something. Mm -hmm. She's one of the ones who looked at it and was like, yo, that's that's lame. (laughs) (laughs) Maybe I should have just way holding up those colors. (laughs) Because my thing is, my favorite shot of any idol concert is like the big wide of the dome or the, the, the mm. venue and it's like the lights like a sea of the same color yeah right yeah, and like, like you're yeah, gonna not get that and... at all with this really right yeah i mean i'm sure there'll be moments but it's like for the most part it's, it's gonna look so sporadic i feel mm. right yeah i think you're right there'll probably be you know like sakurazaka no uta or whatever or like mm. big yeah. you know song moments but other than that, like, you know, I guess when they're doing MCs or whatever, the members couldn't look out like, yeah. oh, hey, look, there's the uh, double mm-hmm. blue or double red. That's my color. Mm-hmm. Hey. But how would but you is, know? Like, how does it, it blends into the next person? Yeah, right? yeah, that's like, true. Oh, is that like me? Yeah. Or, yeah. <laughs> or someone standing next to someone who has two different colors? <laughs> yeah, dude. Is it is that like, is that Watanabe Risa white and blue? Or is that oh. just Inoue Rina fan <laughs> sitting next to Al- 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 Aoi fan, yeah. dude, with blue exactly. and white, dude? <laughs> you know, like, yeah, I don't know. At like that point, I feel like it loses the purpose, right? But mm-hmm. I, I, don't yeah. know. I don't mean to just dunk on this. It's cute. It's a cute idea. Yeah. I don't idea. That's, it's uh, not the first, but yeah. it's Sakura Zaka. I think Koike has the combo here with the white and the pink. Mm. Mm-hmm. Right, let's look at Hinata. Uh, pretty much the same ish, right? Um, yeah, yeah. You know, we got similar color combinations. You know, Manafi has the uh, white and pink here. Katoshi with the double blue. So, Kumi with the uh, light blue and purple. Those aren't like the most uh, common. Um, lightsaber colors yeah you know her being a star wars fan and all maybe they took all those colors and they're like oh, what's left well actually you have the last choice of these two colors oh, i guess i'll get those two. <laughs> <laughs> just like, she just really likes luke and mace windu dude oh Ooh, that mace windu is cool man yeah yeah right. dude cool so, uh, I think your, I think Osushi has the most Hinata Zaka colors, in my opinion. Mm. Maybe Bemiho, but I feel like the yellow. Yeah, for whatever I feel reason. like yeah. Mm. Osushi has the because they use yellow a lot, right? Yeah, they do. Yeah, and then of course the blue. So. Uh. So now, you know, go head on over to the official store to buy your pen lights. Need to be ready. You need, need two of them. Love that mm-hmm. stream. They also have introduced goods. Oh, Ooh. baby. Check out these goods that are all Someone sold get out, me the hat, bro. Please. Look at that. A lot of goods. Oh. Some are pretty cool. The hat's pretty cool. Uh, is that triangular that is cool. uh, design that's, I think, on the back of the shirts? Um, yeah, Sorry. I, I saw the, the eco bags, and I thought they were tank tops. And I was like, yes, dude, finally. <laughs> They're embracing the music festival vibes, dude. <laughs> 
Make That's when I work, buy dude. the bag and I cut the bottoms out. <laughs> just, like, no, exactly. <laughs> uh, just put it on. Um, the shirts, like the the oversized tees, I think are pretty good. Uh, with the W on the uh, left. Mm. All right. mm-hmm. um, and then on the back has like the big design. Pretty cool. I like that. Yeah, yeah. Very geometric. Yeah, I like the back. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Pretty cool. Um, but yeah, a lot of. What do you guys think about the the hoodie, the the Parker, whatever they call it? Oh, yo, that's pretty. Uh, like t- like almost tie dye, right? That's yeah. Pretty cool. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Look at that, and then the back has all their names. Names, which yeah, I don't I really like, idea. but man. I guess it's okay. uh, I, 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 I like it. Just it, it feels more commemorative. Mm. Right? Yeah. But yeah, maybe if you're like trying to get at something to like wear around, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe not ideal. Yeah, I can see that. I think the uh, oversized tees uh, fit more into just like normal everyday general wear. wear yeah. It's mm-hmm. like the other shirts uh, has like the dates. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. The back design is the same as the jacket with the names on it. So. Mm-hmm. Oh, the hat looks pretty cool. I, mean, I think that's the coolest thing on there. Yeah, yeah. dude, I, I legit want the hat, bro. I think overall, the goods are pretty good. All right, who's going? Mm-hmm. Who, who wants to go and get us some stuff? But mm-hmm. The hat is not sold out yet, so we have a chance. If you look at the tees, you know, Few of them are sold out, but the hat, mm. not yet, not yet. And of course, you also uh, the oversized the shirts, and they'll just fit on me like a normal shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Well, um, anybody want to hook a brother up? What some well, let us hats? Know. Let us know. Let's yes. try adding to cost. This time we're serious, okay? We're always yeah, serious, but nobody ever. Yeah, man. Nobody, nobody's ever a bro, dude. No one's taking us seriously. <laughs> um, yeah. It's uh, this weekend. Mm-hmm. Um, the final day for us is on like Sunday morning early. Or it's in the middle of the night, Sunday, or something like that. Saturday night. Um, but all three days will be streamed now, boy. Oh, what a change that is. Ooh, and the first two go. days are cheaper than the third day. Ooh, let's go. <laughs> I, I guess that um, makes sense. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> you only get Because like, everybody group. wants to see them together, right? Yeah. So they're like... Want to go all that's out? That's the, the return, I guess, of Kiyaki mm. Zaka. This is a true W, <laughs> Kiyaki Zaka, right? Yeah, so that's cool. Looking forward mm-hmm. to it. We'll see. We yes. shall see. Excited to see it. Let us go to Nogi Zaka News. <gasps> we have a grad announcement. Oh. Um, Ozono Momoko has announced her graduation and retirement from the entertainment industry. Both at the same time? Peach gang, where y'all at, man? Gang, gang. <laughs> peach gang. F in the chat for peach gang, uh, dude. Yeah, dude. Gang, is, uh... dude. <laughs> Damn, it's like trying to be there, hard, there, but there. you know, you cried and shit. F in the chat for Peach Gang. <sighs> well, it's been five years. Momoko's gonna leave um in September. So it's it's uh it's been quite decided. She's scheduled to graduate mm. on September 4th. 27th single is uh her last single. So yeah, dude. she'll probably do all the activities leading up to the grad. And then that's it, man. She's gone. 
that uh that blog post was sad as fuck, dude. Yep. I haven't read it yet. Yep. She just talked about like, you know, it's like just basically like, you know, experiencing some of like the highest highs and the lowest lows during her time as like a, a member of Nogizaka forty six, dude. I just I don't know. It, it kind of like not to say that you like I ever forget, but sometimes it's always kind of sombering to like sit back and remember that like the reality is they're all just girls, right? They're all just people trying to do their yep. best, dude. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And uh, yeah, sometimes I mean, I, I know I'm not I'm not gonna presume to know what what her motivations are for graduating, but regardless of it, it's just you know sometimes you know I wish people would be kinder when talking about idols, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, there's a part in the blog where she talked about like just being herself and stuff. Like, mm-hmm. you know, she doesn't necessarily have like a character or whatever, like some of the other members mm-hmm. that like mm-hmm. is presented. So it's just being a peach kid, man. And you know what? So, I respect that. You can imagine like, you know, of course, everyone gets negative comments, right? And some people would attack her character or whatever. But then mm-hmm. she's just it's like, that's not even a character, dude. That's just me, bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so that's how it be, man. Mm-hmm. But uh, yeah, that was yeah. Uh, quite a surprise because that was like yeah. right after they did all the music day stuff, um, mm-hmm. and, you know, and it was live and everything, right? Like that show, and they performed. She was in the Senbats, Sakamichi Senbats thing, right? And then, yeah, Mm -hmm. I think she posted the blog first, and then Nogi made their news post or something. And it was pretty close when they released the news. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. That was a bad day. Yeah. Came home and was like, oh, confusion, you know? I was like, what the mm-hmm. foot? But, well, yeah, dude. That's uh, how it is, man, with these idols. Yeah, yeah. I, I feel like, I don't know. Like, of course, we you, know, you start getting used to it, right? Like, enough idols kind of graduate and stuff. But I, I feel like Momoko for me, even though I was never like the biggest Momoko fan, right? I, I always really liked her still. Um, it just, feels like oh man so much potential that was never mm. really you know yeah. like capitalized on right like she you know of course she centered like dual centered her first single but i think that was kind of like the peak of her time in nogizaka right and mm-hmm. so i kind of would have liked to see you know some more exploration there maybe some some actual you know other centers but is what it is, right? You can, you know, to to not not to wax philosophy or anything, but you know, rather than dwelling on what could have been, you just gotta enjoy what you had, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. This game as a surprise, especially because yeah, um, I wasn't expecting it. I guess, um, yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, everyone's like, yo, third gen's like so solid, right? No one's really left yet. It's been like five years. Um, mm-hmm. Yeah. I thought they would like just continue a little bit longer. Uh, so, yeah. I mean, like I've I've had many Oshis, especially from like AKB and stuff. But this one was the most unexpected, I guess. Because mm-hmm. I wasn't really... Like, all the other ones who left, they're like, okay, yeah, they've been in the group for a really long yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, you can see they're mm-hmm, kind of, like, mm-hmm. on their way out, right? But yeah, you, you, like, it slowly showed that they were mm-hmm, leaving, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. But this one was just kind of like, all right, I'm gone. Um, also, like, the retirement thing was... Uh, yeah, I think that's what took me the most surprise. More of a surprise, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, because she's in, she's in a lot of stuff. She's not just in the shows, right? She's in a lot of like variety stuff or like on the radio and stuff like that. So like just like Yeah. That's what surprised me. Yeah. So I who's gonna be my next Oshman? No one yet. Uh 
No one's next in line. She's not even gone yet, man. You gotta uh, yeah, <laughs> chill out, brother. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's not leaving until uh, September. So, uh, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah boy, like boys a, gonna enjoy the time he has left, right? Yes, yes. Yeah, man. Uh-huh. Uh, third gen has like a special place in my heart. Mm-hmm. Almost like Kiaki, right? Because uh, I followed them since they first joined. Mm. Yeah, yeah. And like, I think like Momoko is the, the first one. Like I I, I immediately liked, uh, like when mm. they did those intro episodes in, in Nogichu and stuff. Um, she starts crying. Yeah. She, I don't know. She was like really funny. Um, but I guess some people, you know, found her kind of off-putting. But I don't know. I thought that shit was funny as well. Mm-hmm, so, mm-hmm. Um. Yeah, we'll see what happens. I do stuff on Nogichu and maybe their YouTube channel. Looking mm-hmm. forward to that. Uh, yeah. Another grad, everybody. Another one. Mm-hmm. DJ Khaled. Another one. It's just best. how it be. It's just how it be. That is the idol life. I mean, she lasted a lot longer than most idols. Mm-hmm. Mm. That's the thing. It's like, it feels like, you know, as we become, become idol boomers, time just keeps slipping by faster and faster. So it's like, you know, we were like, oh, man, I feel like, you know, she's just getting started. Blah, blah, blah. It's five years is a long time in yeah. idol career, yeah. right? Yeah. So. Some in any career, and like especially in idol career, uh, yeah. where like, it's super stressed out, right? Because mm-hmm. there's so much like, stuff they have to do. Whole not not everyone's gonna be the eternal ones, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Only the select like, few. Uh, whole mm-hmm. groups don't last five years. You know, yeah, so yeah, exactly. So, um, but like, uh, she is still gonna do the tour, except mm-hmm. the last day, right? Like, oh, uh, on the blog. I think uh, Fukuoka is the last performance. Yeah. Uh, so the tour. will they do, probably do like a grad day for that, maybe? Probably. I mean, that's the last. If that's our last performance. So mm-hmm. They'll probably do something. Um, mm. So, yeah. Oh, this in chat says her grad day is the Sun Keys debut day. Uh, for the marks the fifth year for third gen, mm-hmm. so that's when they decided. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Deuces, <sighs> rip peach yeah. gang, dude. It's hard. Anyway, um, let's keep going. <laughs> How somber! Let's, let's oh. shake it up. Let's shake it out. <laughs> Sheesh. Um, Better news for everybody. Millie Love is releasing her first photo book, y'all. Another thing I did not expect at all. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't think, I mean, I don't think any of us could have called this. This was a this. pleasant surprise, yeah. <laughs> she is graduating, so I guess. I'm like, yeah, you want to do one real quick? Like, yeah. <laughs> August 31st is the release date. Um, you have some previews. Mm-hmm. Kind of, kind of annoyed that this is what it takes for second gen to get some love, dude. True. Uh, <laughs> mm, yeah. Well, oh, there's an Amazon link, Jimmy. It's time for the oh, affiliate link. Oh, you want to <laughs> pick it up? Please check that affiliate link. Um, helps us out, but you know, no extra cost to you. Mm-hmm. Or, exactly. Uh-huh. Um, of course, we have our social medias. Uh, Twitter media underscore one st, and then Instagram is just her official Instagram. Mm. She's oh, they didn't make a special one. A while now, I guess. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, makes sense. Um, Twitter. There's some video messages and stuff. Look at that setting. Damn. Right. Look at that mountain. Look at Almost that like a Windows the Windows background. Wow. Where is that? Where did they, where did they go for this? Y'all know. It's, uh, they went to Hokkaido? Hokkaido. Damn, dude. That'd be looking like, uh, 
the sound of music and shit, bro. Yeah, man. Right? It looks nice. It looks like the, nice the Swiss sense. countryside. Dude. <laughs> yeah, it <goodness. Dress. laughs> um, Looks good. At yeah. least the setting. We'll see uh, when more mm-hmm. previews mm-hmm. come out. Um, oh, speaking of which. Oh, no, I'll talk about it in the first show. I'll, I'll show the photo book that I got. Mm-hmm. Yo, 2200 oh, uh, yen? That's, that's kind of expensive, isn't it? They're trying the to milk book? her out for what she's worth, dude, with his grad photo book, dude. They're like, oh, this is your last chance, dude. Well, I know well, you're going to well, buy it. Maybe they think, like, less people will buy it, so they, like, increase the price a little bit Yo, just to make up for it. It's 24 on, on Amazon. I haven't, like, oh. I stopped buying photo books. Uh, usually it's, like, 17, 1900, isn't it? Josh, you just bought one. How much was it? I know. Let me check. Damn, they're, they're slowly increasing the price, y'all. Oh, uh, dude. Photo books be taxing, dude. Mm-hmm. Um, well, who knows? It's 22. Oof. Um, Euclidean's is 22. Well, I guess Meet that's the norm. 22. I guess this is how it be now, dude. Yeah. Yep. But I think all the ones were 17. I think you're right on that. Mm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure because I, I bought now. those. <laughs> you know? Matsumura's is, is $20, though. See, that yeah, came out before know. and it was cheaper. Chat saying Kosaka's was only 20 dude. What a value. Dang. Oh. Yeah, speaking of, uh, there's enough sold for everyone in Samoa to have <laughs> a copy of uh, Kosaka. Oh. That's just for chat, dude. They, they asked for it. There you go. Okay, okay. Congrats, uh, Kosaka now. Pretty high. Mm-hmm. The highest uh, from... Oh, it's the highest uh, from uh, Hinata Zaka. Mm-hmm. <laughs> There's only like three. <laughs> yeah. <All right. laughs> it's funny. I, I separated my photo books in, in the bookcase now. So like Sakamichi has its own shelf. And like I have like Nogi Zaka and Sakura Zaka. And then like Hinata Zaka is like, all right, here's two. Or three counting the group. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bookshelf. All right, let me let me donate Bemi hose for you so you can <laughs> finally complete the collection. <laughs> I just I just have that and Bemar, that's all I need. <laughs> and Etomiso's oh. very first one, but I don't know if that counts. Ah. Oh, her her gravy one. <laughs> yeah, the very first one. All right. Well, there you go. Millie Love. Uh first photo book, August 31st. Y'all go check it out, man. Um, Check out the affiliate link. Yeah, if you want to pick it up, affiliate link down below. Helps Mm -hmm. us out. No extra cost to you. Yep. Jimmy, I don't see the link yet. He's he's on it, man. (laughs) Let him get on it, man. Damn. (laughs) This guy. Uh, I thought I had to do a podcast right now, dude, but okay. All right. (laughs) Sheesh. (laughs) Anyway. Uh, let's let's move on, huh? To uh, the last thing to talk about this week, Sakamichi series was at the music day. It was a whole day Ooh. of music, and it canceled uh-huh. every other TV show, including My Hero Academia. <laughs> That's why it wasn't it. there when I checked to watch it the other day. I was like, "What? Where's the new episode, yo?" Music, the music day. day. <laughs> Oh, um, yeah. Um, each group, uh, except for Yoshimoto Zaka, uh, performed a song. And then they had the Sakamichi Senbats of Dreams or whatever the hell. For Hinata's performance, they wore outfits from like legendary oh, idols. Yeah. Yeah. Matsuda Seiko and whatnot. Who's, uh, which one is... Uh- Osushi wearing, dude. That looks, looks sick. Osushi's mm-hmm. wearing Nakamori Akina's outfit. What? It, mm-hmm. Like, they should have given that to Kyonk. She's the one that sings her <laughs> songs, man. Uh-huh. What the heck? <laughs> <sighs> Music day. <laughs> you could get their info. She's too short. Dude, done she done info. <laughs> yeah. She doesn't have, like, the, the look, I guess. Too small. Mm. There's so many of them wearing the Onyanko Club. All right. Um, I've been like warming up to this song a lot, actually. Like, I think it's the same for me. Kimishika Uh Katan, everybody. I like when they do the mm. (laughs) Uh when they do the (laughs) long mm. that ooh la 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 part's cool too. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know, I, I, I appreciate the novelty. I'm not I'm not a fan of this concept though. I found it more distracting than anything. Right. Mm. I, I, I can see I can see that angle. Yeah, yeah. Like if they should have all had worn different outfits if they were gonna do this. Right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, like but to at have least match everybody wearing on Yonko Club and then four people being completely different. <laughs> uh huh. Mm-hmm. Because then it makes it look like they're like the important ones and everyone else is like whatever, right? And and it just, it stands out for the rest of the song, in my opinion. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because then they had to show like, oh, this is the outfit they're wearing. For those of you who don't Mm -hmm. know, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But yeah, they, Jess says it would be funny if one brought to wear an AKB outfit. Like the (laughs) Iwaki maybe. Maybe. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, funny. I'd say that's like a classic idol outfit at this point, mm. right? Yeah. Like, I feel yeah. like that's the yeah. look most people think of when they, they think of an idol out uniform yeah, yeah. nowadays. Like, if you would go to, like, a cheap costume place, like, for Halloween, yeah. they probably like have a that. Donkey, yeah, dude. Yeah. yeah, that'd be, like, the idol uh-huh. outfit, right? Well, yeah. obviously, Every time you see, like, a like a generic idol group in an anime, dude, they're always oh, wearing yeah. the red plaid. <laughs> no, uh-huh. That's the uh-huh. plaid, dude. That's pretty mm. iconic nowadays, as far as idols go. But, uh, mm. yeah, they were only doing, like, Showa-era idols for that one, so. Mm. It is what it is. Uh, I guess we're going to the next one. Sakurazaka 46. Apparently, Sakurazaka did some projection mapping to enhance oh. their performance. Yeah, they had some like cool looking effects and shit like that. I I, I love that they're still carrying the uh, artistry that we've come to, to expect from Keiki Zaka days. Mm. All right, like in terms of like the the concepts and the visuals for like performances, I kind of like the the dark setup more. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, they they didn't really show that a lot. I don't know, that was weird. Okay, um, this is cool and all, but like, go back to the edgy dude. <laughs> yeah. Whereas this projections, dude, that you're hyping, bro. <laughs> I know it was only in the beginning, I think, where it was all yeah. dark and shit, and then just like yeah, immediately dude. ran out. Mm. What happened? Yeah, I feel gypped, bro. Right? <laughs> right? They were like hyping that shit up. I take back what I said about the artistry, dude. Oh, this makes me mad, bro. <laughs> like just chilling out off, for the bro. flower company. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, okay. so Sakura was like at some flower place. They weren't even at the studio for that performance. They were like in a completely different area. Somewhere yeah. else in Tokyo. But uh, supposed to be projection map uh, involved, but it was only like the intro. And then they ran mm-hmm. out to like the flower shop. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> Chat says it looks like a commercial for a garden center. <laughs> it's like they went to oh, Home Depot. <laughs> it's like the Home Depot. Like you see like, the prices behind band. sale. Brought to you by Lowe's, dude. <laughs> for all your home gardening needs. Thank you, Sakuzaka. I will buy more plants for my room. <laughs> I'll buy another Weber grill from Lowe's, dude. Hell yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. The shit that uh, makes me... Like, I, I feel like I would have been fine with the performance if they didn't hype up the, the projections mm-hmm. in, the inter- in the beginning. Mm-hmm. That sets you up for, like, false expectations, you know? Yeah. yeah, yeah. Hurdle Takai, bro. Mm-hmm. To Takai. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, let's go to Nogi, I guess. Nogizaka did a medley. Ichiki Rena is there. Uh, it was uh, Matsumura's last, I guess, like TV appearance. Mm. Oh, really? Oh, well, I guess, I guess, yeah. I I kind of like these patterns on these outfits, y'all. That's yeah, interesting. It's a, uh, it's like grandma vibes, but like, yeah. it, it's nice with Guru Guru curtain. I think. Yeah. Right. You know, like those really expensive Hermes. Er- Hermes yeah. scarves. Hermes, it looks, dude. Like it looks like Nogi took a bunch of them and just made them into dresses. <laughs> I always like like the little different colors and stuff, you know. Oh yeah, uh-huh. yeah. The little attention to detail. Mm-hmm. I saw them blog about this. Like all the confetti had messages in them. Oh. To like surprise. And they didn't the read a single one. <laughs> <laughs> just Someone got in the way just over sweeps dancing. them all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No wait. <laughs> Mm. That was mine. <laughs> yeah, so they had messages on them, and like if you check That's the members' cute. blogs after on the day of, 
they took pictures of the confetti and stuff and the messages. Mm. So. Nice, dude. Because it was their 10th anniversary. <laughs> hey, nanny. <laughs> that How one? sweet. Yo, Yuki, this isn't for me. <laughs> yeah, you see her just miss it, dude? Oh, shit. I'm, mm. <laughs> hey, any of y'all what pick a, up what something for me? Goober, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Where's mine? <laughs> we look for mine real quick. We got one more performance, which is the Sakamichi Senbats one. They start with uh, Sing, Sing, Sing. Yeah, How so long the has lineup, it been since we've seen Sakamichi do something together? They've <sighs> never technically yeah, done anything together. Yeah. <clears throat> it, it, 12 members it needed AKB it in. to bring them together. <laughs> <laughs> That's how much it was required. I like how they have uh, the appropriate skirts. Mm. I mean, the other the other two groups. Yeah, you got to be able hey to guys, spin, right? You, you need yeah. the, the skirt to be able to do this choreography or else it mm-hmm. looks whack. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you can have like a Sakura Zaka heavy skirt or something, right? Mm-hmm. We spin and nothing happens, dude. Yeah. <laughs> they need the, yeah, the floaty ones, please. All right, so yeah, these Senbats of Dreams, apparently. Uh, they had six Nogi members and then three from the other two groups. And uh, they did this dance thing with Sing, Sing, Sing. And then they did two Nogi songs. If this is a dream, I must have gotten woken up really early for this dream. What kind of dream is no, this? No, no, it's 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 a it's a it's the Senbots of dreams because it's supposed to put you to sleep, dude. Oh. <laughs> Dang. Dude, that was nice. so disappointing on multiple levels. I came in already prepared to uh-huh. be disappointed, right? Because I was like, all right, from the from jump, you got you got three groups, mm-hmm. twelve member Senbots. Oh, mm-hmm. perfect, dude. They, they they picked the number so we can divide evenly between uh-huh. three groups, right? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So it's yes. going to be four, 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 right? Mm-hmm. Psych. Three, three, six, brother. What? <laughs> Excuse me? How about I give oh, you this p- right here? Pardon? Check out. Well, the reason why it's six Nogizaka socks is that's all we're going to do. Or six Nogizaka members. That's all you're going to get, Nogi socks, dude. Mm. Might as well just be a Nogi medley, dude. Right? <laughs> It was, I mean, it pretty much was a Nogi melody. Yeah. Except for the beginning, which they just danced for. Mm-hmm. Um, like, I, yeah. don't, I don't know, bro. Like, at least I expected, like, one of each, you know, one, one little section of each song. Yeah. Yeah. But I guess they were like... <laughs> you say in chat says, at least he didn't, <laughs> at least he didn't pull an all-nighter to watch that. <laughs> Dude, I've been, I, I would have been pissed, bro. I would have been so pissed, bro. <laughs> Uh, like man, Sakura Zaka songs are, are too hard. Let's not fucking do those. Let's just do Nogi songs. Can we just do Nogi songs? We did Synchronicity at Kohaku, Guru Guru Curtain. You know, you just line up. It's easy. All right, we don't need to do anything else. Mm-hmm. Can we just can we just do? We hug each other for a bit. You know, <laughs> I don't want to learn the other choreography. <laughs> God damn it! Well, I, like, I will say that, like, in my opinion, the three. Sakura Zaka members were pretty strong mm. dance wise. Yeah. But you can see kind of in Sing Sing Sing, right? When it when it, it features each group. Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, you, know, you go to them and they're like they they're pretty put together and then like not that Nogi Zaka's bad or anything like that, but these are different styles, you know. Yeah. Well once the, once it's like the OG members, it's like, okay, 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 we rate it back in, we rate it back in. Yeah. Mm. <sighs> Was uh, I was expecting for, a, a, a five out of like ten, that. and I got like a two out of ten. <laughs> Already with low expectations, came lower. But uh, I think the only takeaway needed- I have from this is mm-hmm. that Momoko was included. Oh, that's good. That's good. Because mm-hmm. even if yeah, they did, I, I think have- the members themselves is the only thing that kept it at a two versus going to a zero. It's like mm-hmm. even if they did have four from each group. Like for Nogi, I thought it would have been like, you know, Sakura Asuka, Ikuchan, and Yamashita or something like that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or even five, they would have just thrown in Yoda. But uh, that's that's what we got. That's it. Some, sometimes it just be that way. 
Sometimes mm. it just be that way. It is what it is, man. Synchronicity is a good song, though, huh? huh? Mm-hmm. huh? Mm-hmm. Yeah, most of it is. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> well, that's it. That was their appearance on the that's music it. day. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's it for the current events. So we're going to go to a quick break. Yo, we're back. What's up? It's time for the comment of the week. This is where Josh picks a comment and talks about it and shares. So what is Mm -hmm. it? All right. So this is a comment from someone. Oh, from who? Someone. Who? Thank you. Who? Someone. Thank you. Thank you, someone. Yeah, it's someone. And they say, commiserations to Boykun for the recent sad news. But yeah, personally, I do feel that a normal life away from the limelight is best for Momoko, no matter how sad it is for the fans. Thank you, Peach Gang. I don't even know if you are, but if you are, <laughs> gang, gang. Yeah, we've talked a lot about it. I think, you know, it's all agreed. Mm-hmm, right, mm-hmm. That, you know. It is better for her to be happy and stay in the group because of obligations. Because mm-hmm. that sucks. Y'all ever yep, been yep. at a job that you did not like? Yeah, dude. That's right my now. job. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like my job at all, dude. Uh-huh. But yeah. Same. It pays the bills, know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Yeah, dude. I hope I hope she lives a happy and full life. Ooh. I hope mm-hmm. she she after she graduates she goes out there, enjoys being out of the public eye, date mm-hmm. someone I don't know you know drinks, yeah. drink get turned party whatever you know mm-hmm. gang gang whatever makes her happy gang gang <laughs> each gang gang uh, you know yeah, maybe, uh, and then some some time along the line in the future she'll come back hey I got an Instagram again and then we can. Look at it like ah, look at how you know, like how other Nobu mm. members are. You know, they yeah, all have Instagram yeah, yeah. and shit, living a normal life. Mm-hmm. <sighs> but it is what it is right now. Still got maybe two months in mm-hmm. the group, so. Mm-hmm. Hey, Momoko, if you're watching this, you know you can still put up covers on YouTube. You know, you play guitar. You know, that could be something. <laughs> work yeah <laughs> hey momoko if you're watching this uh uh follow me back on on instagram oh word Please. word All right. I'm, I'm, yeah. i've been uh, pending for a while now yeah. <laughs> ever since you made that account so. that secret account me up. <laughs> get back to me all right <laughs> i right. every one of your stories you know? <laughs> <laughs> like calling me Hello? It's like voicemail. Uh, oh, hello. Dear Stan. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, Jimmy. Oh, no. Anyway, thank you for the All comment. Right. If you want Josh to pick a comment, then and then leave one, I guess. You know? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. It is what it is. All right. Let's uh, go to the next segment. The TV show roundup. Where we recap weekly TV shows of Sakamichi series groups uh, what is it Hinata Zaka de Aimasho Soko Magatara Sakura Zaka and Nogi Zaka Koji Chu which is on YouTube let's Ooh. go so convenient sometimes we watch other appearances that they have on uh, other shows. I didn't watch any this week. So. Same for me. I only watched one show. Okay. <laughs> so it's hey, just in general. That's, that's <laughs> one show more that I've yeah. been able to in a while. Dude. Yeah, yeah. Which is. We, 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 we making progress. Dude. We yeah, making man. progress. It's all good, brother. It's all good. Um, the first show. Hinata Zaka de Ai Mashou. We're continuing the Chad shit from like it's it's been like three weeks now. The same thing. The Thai man. 
where they mm-hmm. battle Chad and then not Chad. And last week we were rooting for uh, our hero, mm. Kosaka Nao. For, the uh, Sigma male, Kosaka Nao, dude. Let's go. <laughs> She's our only hope. The AU of the people. Um, so she she goes against the Giga Chad, then the O and loses. God damn it. That's the <sighs> end of Hina I. Let's move on to Soko. <laughs> wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. There's more that happened. <laughs> no, our hero lost. This is BS, dude. It's over. But someone rises to the challenge. Uh true. Let's keep going, I guess. God damn it. All right. Uh so uh our hero has been defeated, but there are other challengers who rise up to the rise up queens <laughs> miss kawada uh is also defeated oh. in the first round so she is not the one um and then we had a uh, susan <laughs> susan huh? susan tomita uh oh. for the challenge <laughs> Um, Let's go, Susan. Susan. Susan actually does quite well because they let uh-huh. her pick the challenges. Um, mm-hmm. So she chooses to do the sexy voice thingy, right? Mm-hmm. Um, which uh, she wins. Uh-huh. And then uh, what else? They, they did some kendo action. Mm-hmm. Try to hit the little the inflatable little, ball. Uh, um, she does a nice move, attack to the knee. And they're mm-hmm. like, oh, shit. Nice, brother. Um, and then she goes up against the Giga Chad. Uh-huh. Let's go, Susan. Oh. Uh, it was, I, like, uh, I like the whole stare down into the camera. <laughs> just like yeah, that was pretty it. funny. Just... <laughs> um, Wait, they just like, make dumb faces? The cameraman like kept zooming in. Mm-hmm. Um, Stupid. It was a very involved uh, tug of war with the sushi table. Um, they had to reset a few times because it got kind of dangerous, right? Mm-hmm. Um, she like fell over and shit. Mm-hmm. Oh, <laughs> and no. Kasuga was like, oh, oh no, let's uh, redo, let's redo. That should have uh, counted, I don't know. Uh, oh, Josh is on the side of the chads, man. What? <laughs> No, I'm saying the table went over. I, I, that was the I point, kind, right? I kind of as well. I, I gotta, <laughs> gotta rep, you know. Gotta show these beta cucks, dude. <laughs> <laughs> well, they they reset a few times. Put them you know, back in um, their place, dude. Susan destroys the set by falling into the wall. Mm-hmm. Uh, but in the end, um, she musters up the strength and defeats the Giga Chad. Mm-hmm. And and then and, and then she joins the Chads. Like, all right, Susan, mm. I thought you were one of us, but no, dude. No? See, every every beta male wants to be a Chad, dude. <laughs> and I, I guess, guess she Susan earned the right down, to be a Chad by you know, she did mm-hmm. what they mm-hmm. required of her. Won some uh, knee socks of her own. Mm-hmm. Ooh. So, shout outs to Manamo for having thigh high socks. <laughs> <laughs> Rocking the ZR. All right, let's move on Oof. now. Soko Saku, baby. <laughs> um, they're doing like this voice acting thing or checking their, their uh, voice acting skills or lack thereof. Uh, did, did you guys watch this? I did, but it was no. a sleeper episode. Is this the one show that Jimmy watched? Oh. Nah, nah, dude. Uh, I watched the one on YouTube, brother. Ooh, the easy one. Right Here on. we go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> um, they didn't have to get up, dude. This is on my iPad. Yeah, yes. just on your subscription <laughs> yeah, list. Oh, okay, yeah. time to click on it. <laughs> uh, it is, is... Let that be a lesson to you, rest of the shows. <laughs> Put that shit on YouTube. Jimmy will then watch it. Uh, it was kind of weird. I don't know. They did like some animal noises. Uh, oh, word. Kira I'm is glad involved, I watched the course, one on YouTube then. She, uh, you made the right choice, Jimmy. 
Um, they had some interesting challenges. So like one, they they like read children's stories, but then Tsuchi would change how they would voice like the characters voice the characters that they're trying to they should stuff. play. Yeah, and you know, they changed from normal voice or like a Yankee voice or like a Gyaru or whatever. Um, okay, that part was the good part of this episode. The rest was mm. like uh, Rune Rune was pretty I'll, good. I'll, I'll skim it back later. At, yeah. at the uh, the voice thingy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Um, Ten Chan. Uh, the one that better. surprised us all was uh, Matsuri. She did very well. Oh yeah. Uh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Well, it actually doesn't so surprise me at all. I can I can yeah. see her be doing with yeah. her variety well, skills and everything. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Did uh did did the birthday girl go? No. No. Ah, damn it. It was probably uh, this, dude. <laughs> probably filmed uh, before. Not that her birthday would no. have. Anything would have changed anything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um. But then the second part is uh they they like do voiceovers of, of like a story that involves their mascot characters that they made yeah. a couple months back. Um, that's the sleep of Virgin. Jimmy, when you get to this part, that's when you're okay to go. <laughs> and uh, mm-hmm. it involved Sawabe. Uh, he likes, he voiced Sawabe, the character mm-hmm. that Matsuri made. Um, and there are some moments, I guess, but overall this whole part was just kind of like, are they making fun of voice actors? <laughs> <laughs> Not men, no, they, were, they were just bad. You know, they were just bad. Um, and then they, they try to put Onuma and Kira on the same <laughs> on the same <laughs> voice read. Oh, and it kind of no. You, you expected it to be like <laughs> s- like so bad that it's good, but it's just like no, it's just, just false it's just, plot, I guess. Took a turn for the worst. Uh, oh, possible. come on! Can you give me, I feel like give they were set up. Kiss, dude. I feel yeah. like they weren't set up, or it wasn't like replicated enough. You know. Mm. Yeah, I would like to imagine that they cut a lot of stuff. Oh yeah. Uh-huh. Uh, well, I feel like they could have cut more, like this entire section. <laughs> yeah, even Sawabe struggled. This entire he was episode. Like, what am I doing? Uh... Yes. Yeah. Sawabe was struggling like during this whole time. A. a uh, a, a, a veteran comedian he struggled uh-huh. with this uh-huh. segment so um damn dude next week the backs live members do stuff so that's probably uh, yes that's more interesting yep <laughs> oof <laughs> back live you know just everyone but the everyone eight but members eight of the front yeah, yeah. <laughs> So it's pretty much just a regular studio thing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna skip this. My Oshi isn't in these next few episodes, so I'm good. Oh uh, no, I, I got I got Habu, dude. I know I got I got yeah. Matsuri in there, so there's yeah, I I like a lot of the members back there. So um no problems, you know. Um yeah. so let's go to Nogizaka 46. The Nogizaka. Well, this one made this one was a little weird to me. I don't know what about it is weird to you. <laughs> Strange indeed. The entire premise of the show. Because individually, the segments are fun. Uh-huh. But but the, the whole like, oh, who gets to be? Shitara's no owner, dude. Oh, no. <laughs> I said it's Shitara's a... no owner, dude. <laughs> Fucking it's possessors. weird because it's Matsumura Sairi. <laughs> this is supposed to be like a yeah. graduation special. But yeah. no, it's like... You know, she has like a thing uh, with Shitara, right? Um, yeah. He's always all soft to the other members and she gets all jealous mm-hmm. and shit like that. And so mm-hmm. it's her just forcing the other members to compete. <laughs> yeah, yeah. For, <laughs> but I guess it's it kind love. of like her style. Yeah, I mean, if, if, you, if you watch this enough, if you know Sai Ringo, then, you know, it's, that's how she be, man. That's just how mm-hmm. she yeah. is. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so they play various games and winners get points at the end. They mm-hmm. get a prize mm-hmm. from Matsumura Sayuri herself. Mm-hmm. First game was a uh, tug of war game. Mm-hmm. Um, of course, uh, Matsumura like loses every game because <laughs> she's just terrible. The joke, right? Oh well, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I I thought for sure Ray was gonna like win this against everyone. Nah, bruh. she went up. But against, she lost. 
Okay. Nice. Wait, Long, dude, with the secret strength, dude. I don't know, right? That lower center of gravity strength and wrapping it around too, right? Yeah. Do you know why? It's because Umezawa has all those hidden calories, dude. She's able, to, she's able to leverage all the muscle glycogen to its fullest, dude. <laughs> all that <laughs> lean muscle. All right, all right. Was it was Asuka? Was like, oh yeah, dude. When we go on cheat days, dude, she just fucking eats, bro. <laughs> all the all the proteins, brother. All gone. Yeah, dude, uh-huh. she's, she's just been hiding gains under these nogi outfits, dude. <laughs> Is it me? I just noticed this. Is it me or they do? Does the show only use this the graphic for Ume? The, the thing that looks like mayonnaise? They only use that for Ume, right? I've never yeah, seen Yeah, there's it. certain members who only have certain things, yeah. Yeah, mm-hmm. okay. I don't pay attention enough. A- any tips yeah. Any tips for Ray, Jimmy, if she's watching? Uh, she's got to hit the gym, bro. <laughs> <Just> <laughs> more strength, you know? She's just, you know, just, some, got, uh, she just, she just <laughs> got wrecked, dude. It was just pure power, dude. Ooh. There you go, dude. <laughs> Yeah, uh, that's why then, that's why Umezawa had to join Nogizaka, dude. If she joined AKB where they wear short skirts, you just seen her her fucking quads, dude. It's like, oh damn, is that girl an Olympic cyclist? Wow, she's got the two twenty five, dude. <laughs> two plates, Ume. Let's go. Yeah, dude, that was Ume at the gym, bro. <laughs> yeah, I was like, oh, fuck. missed out. Um, but then you see the difference <gasps> between Ume and Himura San, dude. Oh yeah, uh-huh. they gave him uh-huh. a handicap, pulled that shit with one arm. Looking weird while he did, did it, but yeah. <laughs> he's a little hops yeah. back. He, he got the job done. He, he got yeah. the job done. All right. Uh-huh. Um, what else they do? They did the uh, Mune Kune thing. You know. Like, yeah, all those different mm. scenarios. Oh, the scenario. Mm. Yeah. Like, for Shitara, right? Like, oh, you, you got yeah. this. And it's it was like sent in, right? Like the scenario suggestions or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um. Oh. And then Shitara would pick who he liked the most. Mm-hmm. There are some good ones in there. The Hoshimina one was cute. Mm. Mm. I thought uh, the Higuchi one was the best. But that was yeah. like like you said, it was more doki doki, right? Yeah. It's supposed to be. Yeah. But then Himura also took uh Yeah, dude. He, he also Pull participated. The forbidden the forbidden Himuko, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Cause you know, Himura's been Together, which is uh, the longest, man. These mm-hmm. Nogi girls mm-hmm. ain't got none. Mm-hmm. Uh, they also played the Janken, like Achimui Tehoi, but they have to mm-hmm. lose. Yeah. Right? So wherever Shitara points, they have to look. Um, and the only one to lose, Sayu Ringo. <laughs> as, uh, as planned, I guess. Uh-huh. I like when Himura did it, and it was like the first tie like oh, yeah. <laughs> <Yeah. same way. laughs> it's all hype dude like yeah. the the bond is she was there. so quick bro banana mm-hmm. men out mm-hmm. here mm. uh they like skipped over this quiz which i thought would have been interesting to see maybe yeah but they like but i think he was just too good at it so they're just like oh let's just skip this ah <laughs> uh, probably uh at the end they do like the smell quiz they, they gotta try to this one is like what? find out which one Shitara's shirt is from the smell. Mm. Um, two are not his. There, there are three. Right? Mm-hmm. Two of the two of the bags, I, I guess. Kind of weird. <laughs> Can yeah, maybe that's the thing there. You know, I don't know. Mm. I, I mean, I'm sure it is, but I was just like, ha, huh. mm. <laughs> okay. Because right. you know they're gonna know how how he smells being this far away. Right, like I like how the um, on the fourth gen girls are like well we don't you know we don't hang out with them that much mm-hmm. we haven't known him for that long mm-hmm. so uh, they were just guessing right uh-huh. mm-hmm. uh, in the but, end uh, even Himura who knows, who has known him the longest yeah couldn't get it dude. Mm-hmm. but uh he got the most points so he won the prize mm-hmm. now he is just I don't know Onna. Yeah, he, he's <laughs> own Onna, dude. And then uh, the prize was like this this ring with Shitara's oh, yeah. head, uh, face on it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, and yeah, Himura is the winner. Weds him and shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Put it on your finger, <laughs> bro. Yeah, yeah. Hey, bro, come here. I, I love you, bro. Banana man. <laughs> there you go. 
Uh, next week, some more uh, Matsumura Sayuri grad stuff. Oh. So it's not over, y'all. Mm-hmm. It's not over. That's it. Yeah, but this show is over. So thank you guys so much for watching this week's episode. Right, right. Uh, yes. You... Why my brain just blank, dude? Thank you guys so much for watching this week's episode. Uh, if you haven't already, if you're watching on YouTube, make sure you hit that subscribe button or come give us a follow on Twitch at twitch.tv slash slope club. Come hang out with us for the live the live thing when we do a record and hang out with chat, the post show, pre show, and the break. Uh, but in between that, you can always keep up to us, keep up to date with us on our socials. But we'll see you guys next week. Bye. Bye. Bye.